Welcome back guys, Sean Lar here with a, another update sort of video thing. Um, but this is my New Year's video and I know I'm like half a month late, but uh, I was going to do this right away last week, like at the beginning of the year, but then that didn't work out and I was going to do it the week after, but then it didn't work out because of exams and this week because of exams. But finally I'm getting around to it and there is a bit of stuff I want to go over because it is now 2016 and there's going to be a lot of cool stuff with my channel um, to talk about at least. So in the background here I just needed something to put in the background so this is um, Don't Starve. I don't know why the sides got cropped off like they did but hey they did. I'm using up my precious video time right now so <laughs> yeah let's go just go let's just get at it. Uh, quick Let's start off with a revamp of 2015, just like a recap, not revamp, I don't know why I said revamp. Recap, uh, we reached a couple of subscriber goals, so that I met so many more of you, um, I made some cool montages, I made a lot of cool fun videos, and I don't know, I didn't really prepare for this video, so I guess I don't have a lot planned for this part, the recap of 2015, but yeah, uh, in the comment section, one of these things I'm going to ask you, uh, if you feel like posting is, what was my... What was the favorite thing I, like, what was your favorite thing that I did this year? Leave it down below. I, or not last year, last year, last year, 2015. Uh, or just in the past in general. Just, you know, what did you guys enjoy? Second, now we're, we're getting into some slightly more serious stuff. Last year, in 2015, I set a goal for my channel. And it was a very ambitious goal. I know that. It was 1,000 subscribers. And I know we didn't reach that, but... Like I said, it was very ambitious. I was really going out there, but you know, you need to do that because that's the whole point of goals, something to really strive for. But yeah, I didn't get there. We got to 500 subscribers, which is 500 subscribers, which is still amazing. And I think for this year, I want to set a new goal that's just as ambitious, if not even more ambitious. I'm going to set it at 2000 subscribers. I think it's possible. I think that if I really try and if you guys are there to support me and all that, I think it's possible. I'm not saying I'm going to be there, I'm just saying that's what I'm going to try to get at. So those of you and haters in the comments that want to say like, oh, you think you're going to have 2,000 subscribers. No, no, I don't think that I am. I'm saying I want. That's what I'm going to try to strive for. That's my goal. Um, the second thing I want to go over, and now this is getting into some more serious stuff about the channel, and that is the sort of shift that you've already been seeing starting to happen a little bit. Um, of me playing more games on my channel other than just Minecraft. I've been doing this for a while, but just recently I've been kicking it up even a little more. Um, and that's just because, for it's for a couple of reasons, but really I just wanna, I want to slowly shift my channel away from Minecraft. Not entirely, there's still gonna be, the channel's still gonna be largely Minecraft. It always has been, it will be for quite a while, but there are a couple of reasons why I wanna do this. One. Minecraft is losing popularity slowly on YouTube as well as just in general. Um, it is getting old, but it's still very popular. I still enjoy it, especially with friends and stuff, so I'm still going to be doing, making videos on it. And then there's also just the side of, like, me playing it as a 15-year-old. It's starting to be a little less, I shouldn't say acceptable, but, like, in school and stuff, I don't feel as comfortable bringing up my YouTube channel because I do so much Minecraft on it. There's a lot of stereotypes that get put on in on that, especially when you're talking to more gaming friends and stuff. So even though I don't have anything against it personally, I do feel a little uncomfortable sometimes bringing it up. So I want to have a nice wide coverage on my channel. Um, and I hope you guys stick with me. And even if you're mostly just here for Minecraft stuff, maybe check out a couple of my other series that I do on other games. See if there's stuff you might enjoy seeing me do. But yeah, that is something I think I'm going to be doing. I'll still do a lot of Minecraft, but I want to try and integrate more games into my thing. So if you guys have suggestions on games you would like to see or see more of, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. The next thing I want to talk about, and I know we're starting to get a little long here, um, is we're getting about, what is it, about five minutes, four and a half, something like that? Anyway, um, it's something I've been thinking about for quite a while, actually, probably through most of last year and maybe even a little um, beyond that. But for a long time, I've been thinking about sort of wanting to make a second channel, not like a new channel, not changing it, but a second channel um, for like vlogs, not necessarily vlogs, more vlog type videos, like IRL videos. I don't, not necessarily just vlogs where I sit down and talk about things, but just, just a general channel for me to have a little bit of a different connection with you guys, um, a more physical connection, I guess that's not quite right. Just a more personal connection, because it's not me through game, it's me in person. Um, 
I've been wanting to, or I've been thinking about doing this for a while, and recently I've really kind of wanted to a bit more, and then one of my friends just got up and did it, <laughs> which I was not expecting, but it worked, it's been working out for them, I think, and I, I've time to reach the point where I just decided I want to try this, I want to do it, so I I think sometime this year, maybe sometime sooner this year, I think, I'm not sure, I'm not guaranteeing this, but I think I'm going to make a second sort of channel for IRL type videos. It won't, it won't be a replacement of this channel, this will still be my predominant channel, but I might make a video on there once a week or once every couple of weeks, I don't know, it all depends. Um, and I'll still have vlogs on this channel for some more important things. Really, I was going to make this a vlog, but I didn't really get around to it. Anyway, uh, the last thing kind of related to that is face cam. I've asked this before, but I want to know if you guys think I should be integrating... Should I try integrating more face cam into my videos? I have the capability to. Uh, sure, it takes more time, and that goes back onto another topic that I've brought up before. And that's, should I make less videos and put more editing t into them? That would be something that would count in with this doing face cam and doing more editing and stuff. Less videos a week, maybe every other day, or three times a week, or something like that. And then add face cam and add more editing, something like that. So yeah, this video is about to end, so I'm going to have to add a little black screen in here, but I'll talk quickly, so I'll go away in just a second. Um, yeah, that's it for my sort of 2016 update type video. Uh, please remember, if you did, not necessarily enjoy, but get something out of this video and have some time, leave a comment answering whether I should do more face cam, put more editing into videos, um, what maybe games you would like to see, What and uh, I think I asked at the beginning, what was your favorite thing from 2015 or before? Sort of what did you enjoy the most? And anything else you might like to leave in there. So yeah, I hope you guys are excited, as excited for 2016 as I am, both on its own and in like on my channel here and on YouTube. And yeah, I guess that's it. So I will see you guys next time. Shut up, John.